Continue where I left off and read it again. She also indicates a prize that is worth obtaining. It said that the Swedish fruit is at the top of the tree and therefore worth the climb. The Velvet Queen lets you know that your most prized dream is within reach through a combination of letting life unfold as it will and your own disciplined efforts. Don't give up. You cannot make the fruit of the tree grow faster. That will happen according to the <coughs> rhythm of life. But you can certainly do your part to be ready to climb the tree at the right moment to savor the sweetness of success. Healing trick. To help you take the wisdom offered and put it to best use in your life now, do this healing trick to clear obstacles to putting this guidance into place. Say the following statement aloud. I release all fears and judgments I have made in this or any lifetime about material possessions, fear of loss, fear of greed, fear of distraction, and fear of attachment. Open my hands and heart to receive all I need when I need it, for as long as I need it, to live my beautiful and unique life path. You are now going to visualize, imagine, feel, or pretend that you can breathe in and out through your entire body. You can inhale deeply not only through your mouth or nose, but also through your skin. As you inhale gently, you take in the gift of life. As you exhale gently, not only out of your mouth and nose, but also out of your pores of your skin. You easily release what you no longer need, even if you don't consciously know what it, that is. Do this for several moments. When you feel relaxed and clear, say this statement three times. I receive a sweet and rare prize destined to be mine through the power of love divine. You have finished your healing trick. Affirmation. Say the following affirmation aloud to boost the power of this message and to integrate it into your body, mind, and soul. You can say it in morning and or evening for a few days or even a few months or just at the end of your healing trick. I am strong and have surrendered into the perfection of life's loving grace. And the final card, what does the universe most want us to understand about the potential impeachment of Donald Trump? What do we got here? Maven of Mass. Number 44. What do you want to be? Try that self on for size. You might just discover another genuine facet of you beyond your known identity. The maven of mass tells you, act as you wish to be and so shall you, so you shall be. Have you ever felt the liberation of feeling like a different person when on a holiday, traveling in another part of the world or stepping into a world where people don't know you? The masks have come off and you get to choose who you are going to be. You might feel unfamiliar ways of being, more assertiveness, more confidence, more vulnerability, more feminine or masculine energy, all rising up from within you. These ways of being might not seem like you, not the you that you have thought yourself to be, but just because they are different, new or familiar doesn't also make them inauthentic. Quite the opposite, the main mask card comes to you when it's time to try another personality for size to see how much of it ends up being authentically you just a newly discovered you but true nonetheless have you heard the expression fake it till you make it some people don't like this idea they feel it is not genuine it depends on how you use the idea to your advantage there is a difference between pretending to be someone or something you are not and experimenting exploring expressing yourself you know is within you but are you yet to fully realize yourself to be in truth we have the entire universe with us within us if you want to discover new qualities in you you are going to have to start somewhere believe first of all that you have discovered depths and diversity in you second you have to play not playing acting but playing what is it like to show up for life as if you already have all the courage and sass you long for or all the creativity and confidence you yearn for. See yourself as that person as having those qualities. Otherwise, you are like a bird who is yet to fly. It's in you. you but you have to have faith first. And act as if you do. The bird who has never flown has it in him to fly. But he has to make the leap of faith to realize this for himself. 
healing trick. If you have a real mask, use that for this exercise. Otherwise, you can create a mask with your hands by simply covering your face. Say aloud, I now discover new facets to me. I am ready to play with the possibilities. Cover your face with your mask. Say I am. Then quickly remove the mask and call out a quality. Let it be the first thing that comes to mind. You might surprise yourself. Some qualities to get you started might be strong, sexy, wild, confident, creative, sensitive, insightful, playful, spontaneous, powerful, purposeful, smart, sassy, bold, courageous. Start with these if you like, and then see what else occurs to you. It doesn't matter if it doesn't feel completely natural for you yet. If it's occurred to you, it's in you. It just needs a chance to develop. So here's your chance to begin that process. Let your imagination run free as you continue the process of putting on the mask, then removing it, and calling out a quality. If you can call our out qualities uh, you are less confident or familiar with, all the better. See if you can discover something about yourself that you didn't know before. You have finished your healing drink. Affirmation. Say the following affirmation aloud to boost the power of this message and to integrate it into your body, mind, and soul. You can say it in morning and or evening for a few days or even a few months or just at the end of your healing trick. 